Billy Ray, what does Fred Couples have? Well, he's got 258 to the front, and he definitely can get there, in my opinion, here. Beautiful tee shot. After making the bogey at the par 4 ninth, he beat birdies at 10-11, so he's got a little run going here. Anything up into the green, Billy Ray, or even the left would be good. Bunker's not a bad play either. Yeah, he's got to go up the left-hand side, as you oh. said, Lane, with that whole location on that right. Just skirts that bunker there. That's not bad right there. Even though it misses the green, he's going to have the entire length of the green to work with for his third. Yep. Mint condition. Couldn't get a better day to play. Temperature in the high 60s, just a light breeze. Typical desert weather this time of year. Yeah, and Fred's always had great touch. Good hands, nice, languid, soft little swing. You know, watch this ball chase out. It'll definitely come over that little ridge oh. there. And he left it below the hole, so that's a good lead for Fred. And this is the putt that Lanny talked about here. You got to keep it inside left here. You get it outside the left here, and the ball's not going to break that much. Back up the hill. Definitely the, the miss here is left off the tee. Looks like on a pretty good line for Fred to start. Yeah, just left center. Should chase out nicely. I have to leave him a great angle. Yeah, it was well done there. Well thought out and well executed there for couples. Fred has a great setup, great angle. 119 yards and once again this whole location just six paces over this bumper so you have to match up your trajectory and your distance perfectly here to get it close it's coming in very high from a little left to right little push cut there oh right over top of the flag stick great little spin control back down the hill excellent fred couples now a couple of feet, Billy Ray, but you got to pay attention to this one. <laughs> yeah, just get it started. It, it's still a tricky putt. All right. That's three of the last four holes Fred Couples has made birdie. Got it moving in the right direction now. It, it is yards. deep back there today, Billy Ray. That hole location is all the way in the back. It's so far back that there's actually a backstop right behind the hole today. Yeah, trying to bring this ball in high, left to right. This is a good-looking shot here, Lanny. Should work a little bit right here. Maybe come off that slope. Let's see. Leaves himself a nice uphill look from about 20 feet. Not much in that putt. Now couples for his birdie at 14. Well, he's got the hot hand. He's birdie three of the last four holes. Seen this putt already a couple of times, Billy Ray. Not much in this at all. Just got to be bold with it. That's it. Like How that. about that? Center cut there for couples. It didn't move at all. He great read there by Fred. I would go at that uh, the big tree. Well, I understand that. Yeah, yep. Yeah. No, you. you're fine. All right. Very interesting. This 15th hole par five. You see couples going with the iron off the tee. 240. We'll get you the water on the right hand side. Really no room to fit driver up there. You'd like to just kind of squeeze it up that left hand side, get it in the fairway. Fred Couples now third at 15 from just in the right rough. Yeah, perfect lie. That's not going to hinder him whatsoever. He'll also, I believe, try to use that backstop a little bit here, flights it down. This one also is going to have a lot of spin. See if it comes off this slope. We got it way back there. Here it goes. There's a lot of slope. That's pretty well done. Back down the hill, not much to it. Just gets it started, John. He respected the speed probably a little bit too much. Yeah, you know, I think he had a little pull in that also. Even though he missed left, I don't think it broke over all that much, as you said. Sounds like a good club for Fred. I think he can just make a normal practice tee swing with this one. You should, should be just right, Billy Ray. Yeah, it should be just fine. He'll set up left and actually throw it way up in the air, and he's done just that. Needs to get up. to stay there it does a couple of years ago when Tom Lehman won in 2017 Steve Stricker had the lead with three holes to play made it a three putt bogey here at 16 now this is an interesting play with uh, Fred he's got less than driver Billy Ray so that tells me he's got to go he's going right of the 
of the penalty area. You know, you have to. I mean, I think, you know, with this uh, three wood that Fred has, he can get it out there far enough where he can actually get to the par five and two if he puts the ball in the fairway. Looks like he started the water trying to cut it back to the right. On oh, that oh, ball no. is in the penalty area. He's going to aim this way to the right, try to hit that little push cut. Hopefully he catches it perfectly and has a little bit of spin. Struck it nicely. Uh, that was set up right there. That was the only yep. thing he could do. He can get away from me quickly here. Powered it through the break, and he's got a couple of feet left. Yeah, a lot more work and definitely bring your coin here. See if he sets this just left of that white box, maybe just right of our booth down there with a little, little baby cut. Ooh, pulled it left. Yeah, that, that's going to hit that spine. That's gone. It's going to kick left here. No way that stops. And the end of the penalty area. That was a double cross for Fred. Yep. Yeah, most players in the field don't have that play. Uh, no. No. Now, Fred, she said, ball just above his feet here. Coming off that bogey, disappointing bogey at that, at a reachable par 517. Yeah, Fred, he got him back going pretty well and not not the finish he was looking for, Billy Ray. No, not at all. Carried it just a little too far. That is going to be quick also, just over the back edge. Seemed pretty relaxed on the practice tee when we visited with him this morning. Got to be careful with this down the slope and okay. just gets started landing. Pretty good weight there. Oh, what a par that is. Drives it in the penalty area off the tee. How about that for? That's the kind of bring you back <laughs> to play one more day. Meanwhile, over at the 11th, Fred Couples for his par. Bogies at nine and ten for couples. And used that putter very well. Nice save there, Fred. Fred Couples playing his second into the twelfth. Well, you would think Freddie would have enough length to get there. Still has to be a solid shot. Get it riding the wind up with it. Oh, yeah. Actually over the green into the back bunker. Third shot for Fred Couples at the 12th. Back into the wind, should be able to stop. It gets it at about six, seven feet, not bad. Kind of a quick little stroke there by Fred, not his best. 13th now, Fred Couples, second shot. Drove it in the right bunker. Just has to fly it over the right greenside bunker to get it chased back there. And that'll be a little quick little putt coming back down the hill. And we're going to the 13th and Fred Couples for par. He's, remember he hit his second shot just off the green to the right, had that slick putt down the hill and ran it about eight feet by and not a good day for Fred. Fred Couples going the wrong way today. Birdie putt at 14. Yeah, from just short right and underneath the hole, this has to work a little right to left. Not much, and Fred overcooked it out to the right. Fred Couples now, birdie effort at the 15th. Let's see if Fred can finish out strong. Kind of wipe that one going back down the hill. Over at 16, Fred Couples on the tee. See if Freddie can take enough club to get it back to that whole location. Right on track. He does. Now we've got somebody back at the hole. Really well done there by Fred. 
Fred Couples trying to record the first birdie at 16 today. Has it up on the proper level. It's got to work right to left. Just a little bit too high. Up to the 17th and Fred Couples for Eagle. Tough day for Fred. Well, there you go, Fred. Give us a little bit of a smile. Over at 18, Fred Couples coming off an eagle at 17, trying to finish off eagle birdie finish. Good shot here at 18 to get it back to that hole location. 